we're uh, pre-running the Underpower Tour. It's coming up here in what, like six weeks? Six weeks, first weekend in June. And uh, I think we got a pretty cool route picked out this year. Um, we're currently driving through the mountains in Idaho. Looking for our first uh, destination. We've got some new people coming up this year, uh, which will be really cool. Can't wait to show you guys what uh, the vehicle lineup is going to, going to be. And it's not too late if you want to join us. You can sign up below, we'll put some links down below with some more information where you can uh, get a hold of us and uh, join us this year. That's where we're meeting Friday night at the Snake Pit in Kingston, Idaho. It's the oldest continuously ran restaurant in the state of Idaho. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, should be some good food and a great place to meet up. And then that is the end of the freeway. Um, so yeah, excited to see what the rest of this trip looks like. You got a name for this car yet? Well, yes and no. My previous daily driver was a purple minivan and purple and for some reason I always called it the Barney Fife Mobile because I don't know why, just because purple and Barney, I don't know, and it was a purple minivan. But now that I have a cop car, I feel like this really is the Fife Mobile and so in honor of Barney Fife, and I feel like that might be your name. Yeah, the Fife Mobile. The Fife Mobile. It's Crown Vic, right? Yeah. Please send us something. This Crown Vic rides so nice. This is a pretty dang good road trip car. So it feels like it's got lots of power. And my seat's comfortable, so I'm wore out. Mine, mine's had a lot of butt time in it, <laughs> being that it was a previous uh, highway control car. But it still, it still rides nice. Got plenty of leg room. I don't know if I'm gonna buy myself a Ford, but if you if you had to, this if is I had to. Look. This ain't too bad. Short little bathroom break. Road trip's been pretty awesome so far. Look how that water is. Oh yeah. I think glacier went off by this. That snow went off that. But it's ice cold. I bet it's cold. I'm gonna guess if my kids are here, they say, can we go swim in it? Yeah. <laughs> Dude. What? <laughs> Every time. What? Every time we end up off road. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna make this. Yeah, I will. Nice. So I believe we're going over Thompson Pass right now. Yeah. And there is still quite a bit of snow. 
don't think it's going to be on the road. So I'm sure they've plowed this. Yeah. But it's getting close. The sledding. Oh. Yeah, we got some elevation. Look at that. We were we were down there on that road. Right there, yeah. And in and just a far. short amount of time. This is incredible. Did he say what we were at? Blossom. This is Blossom Lake. Blossom Lake is somewhere. Whoa. Here. I don't know if it's excellent articulation. <laughs> this guy's what, you're six four? Six six? So, that's how deep the snow is. It's pretty deep. Ah. All right, so we made it to where we're gonna stay Friday night. We're at the Riverfront uh, Motel. In Kevin's. So, anyway, super nice lady. Got us all set up with our rooms. We'll put the uh, contact information down below so you can uh, call and reserve your room. And it's right on the river. It might be a little chilly, but uh, I think we might have to do a little polar bear plunge Saturday morning. We just uh, fueled up Sandpoint. This is our first stop on Saturday, I think. What did we get from Alex? Um, anyway, the route takes us like basically right downtown, so. Nice. 23.7 miles to the gallon in the Vic. Heck yeah. So yeah, the route takes us like right downtown and also right by Napa. So while all the dudes are fixing our rigs, the ladies can go shop shops downtown. Uh, and then grab a coffee and be on our way to Republic. Yeah. So, but Sandpoint is a cool, cool little town. Lots of cool stuff to look at. So. Which way are we going? That uh, way. that way. Absolutely fantastic. Probably, you know, drive through some of them downtown areas that we just missed. Downtown Colville is pretty cool. Might stop in uh, Kettle Falls, check out, you know, some of the old equipment that's up there. But definitely loving the scenery. How many different rivers have we passed? Oh, much. Here's one of our stops. <laughs> it's a little closed right now. Probably 
due to that. Maybe six weeks it'll change. Yeah, hopefully. No cat. Did you want some lunch? Yeah. Alright. All right, we just finished up some lunch at Stevo's. Yeah. Pretty good place. We had burgers. Um, we're in Republic right now. Not much to it. But there's a racetrack here. So Saturday night we're gonna watch some circle track racing. Should be a really good time watching the, I think it's a dirt course. Yeah. Yeah. So, dirt oval track, watch some racing, and then this part that we're on right now will be Sunday, where we head back down south and uh, hit catch a ferry. Alright, we made it to the ferry. Just the last little bit before we make it back to Cheney. So, looks like we just missed it. This is the reservoir behind Grand Coulee Dam. <clears throat> so you can see like they dropped the water down a lot. Underpower Tour 2022 is gonna be pretty rad. Five mobiles looking good. Underpower tour, I think it's gonna be pretty freaking awesome. A lot, are, of, a lot of great views. Yeah, awesome views. Still a lot of snow up there, but it should be cleared up in the next six weeks. Plenty of wildlife, bald eagles, turkeys, deer. Yeah. A couple rock chucks. And we got a ferry ride. Yeah. Pretty sweet. So anyway, uh, first weekend in June, I think third, fourth, and fifth. Come join us for the underpowered tour. We'll be leaving out of Spokane or Clarkson. Or anywhere you want. Just meet us at uh, 
The Snake Pit in Kingston, Idaho. Kingston, Idaho. Yeah. On Friday night, we'll do dinner there. Stay the night in Thompson Falls Friday night. And then uh, head on over to Republic, Washington. Um, check out a few sites along the way. Watch some racing Saturday night at, in Republic. And then head back Sunday. Yeah. So, anyway, that's all we got for you this time. Wheel it, wreck it, wrench it, repeat. See you next time. See ya.